Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see how to invoke Salesforce skills based routing rules once the record is created. We may have a scenario or a situation where the case record was created with incomplete details. Case records from web to case or from email to case. It will be um, updated by the agent or an admin or by a supervisor. Once all the details are filled, then we may have a requirement where we wanted to call the skills based routing rules which we have configured. For this, we can make use of Salesforce flow. In the Salesforce flow, we can make use of route work action and then we can select run skills based routing rules. I have set up skills based routing rules. Let's see the skills based routing rules for case object. I am using case type. If the case type is mechanical, it should be assigned to an agent with mechanical mechanical skills. If it is electrical, then it should be assigned to an agent with electrical skills. This is my requirement. So I have set my skills based routing rules. Next, I created a simple routing configuration with the units of capacity as one. I'm, I'm using units of capacity as one and use with skills based routing rules is disabled. I should not enable this option here. Next, I created a field in the case object of data type checkbox. Use skills based routing rule. If this checkbox is enabled, then I wanted to trigger my flow and then I wanted to route it using skills based routing rules. This is my sample flow. It's a record triggered flow on case object. Whenever a record is updated. Okay, I have to make sure this only when when a record is updated to meet the conditions requirement, it should not trigger each and every time. My condition is whenever this use skill based routing rule checkbox is enabled, then only it will fire this flow. Immediately it will call route case, uh, which makes use of route work action. Record ID is the case ID, service channel is case, route to skills. For skill requirements, I have to make uh, use of my skill based routing rules. And then I'm using routing configuration as a case. This routing configuration is for capacity calculation. So my flow is ready. I'm activating it. As of now, in my skills backlog, I don't have any. Let me create a new case. So I'm creating a case, it won't fire my uh, skills based routing. As per my flow criteria, it will run only when a record is updated and meet the uh, condition. I'm setting the type as uh, mechanical so that it will go to an agent with mechanical skills. And I'm uh, setting uh, use skills, skills, uh, skill based routing rule that I'm, enab I'm enabling it click save so if I go to my Omni supervisor it uh, the case was uh, triggering the flow and the flow ran route work action and then it triggered my skills based uh, routing rule since uh, uh, the case type is mechanical it is waiting for an agent with the mechanical skill to accept the case record. So using Salesforce flow, we can easily invoke skills based routing rules, which we have configured. I hope it was helpful.
Thank you for watching.